Hi everyone, welcome to another Juniper webinar edition. My name is Miguel Angel Hinojosa and it's a pleasure for me to be here with you to talk about the new concept of Juniper Parallel Search and how it works in our demo. Regarding the webinar, you can appreciate that you have a control panel on the right hand. There you can make questions and I will answer them during the webinar. If there is no time to answer them all, I will respond to the remaining ones via email. So let's start from the beginning, checking the content of the presentation. Uh, we'll be going to see an introduction, uh, the concept of what is parallel search, uh, how it works, uh, what benefits add to your business, and then we'll proceed to show it in a demo in live. Finally, we will end with a brief overview and let you know where you can find more information about this new model. So let's move forward to see the introduction. Uh, in this diagram, uh, we can observe all the currently available models in Juniper. First, let me highlight the ones that we have covered in previous emails. We have seen predefined packages as, as XML suppliers and hosted contract, dynamic packages, uh, business intelligence, unique hotel, promo codes, e-learning, and our web responsive in our B2B and B2C version. Keep in mind that all our former webinars are uploaded in our YouTube channel and in your support online and are available there, okay? Okay, so second, today we are here to talk about parallel search. We have just highlighted in red the models that are affected. Only work for hotels. Uh, well, here is, uh, is uh, check as accommodation, okay? Doesn't matter if it's external supplier or hosted contract. Um, works only for uh, web, uh, B2B, B2C, or Y label. Okay, and only works uh, with Uni Hotel previously activated. But what is parallel search? Here we have tried to find three definitions that define exactly what this means. Uh, parallel search is a module that allows you showing results of hotel in a much faster way, improving the interaction that you have with your users. Also, it's a model uh, that can help you to optimize yourselves, as you will be able to configure that what hotels will be shown in the first places in a faster way. And given that, as many studies seem to point out, the hotels that are displayed in the first position have larger conversion rates. Okay, once we have seen that, let's see how it works. As you can see in the first diagram, the supplier sends the information to us and this takes time, normally around seven, eight, 10 seconds, uh, that depends on the hotel that we request because it's not the same if you ask for 50 hotels or for 500, okay? Or uh, the timeout that you set up for this product, in this case, accommodation or hotels, okay? But what happens when we integrate this new model? By the time you start looking for results, uh, Two searches are sent instead of one, as you can see here. At the top part in blue color, some hotels will be shown in a faster way because the request is smaller, as we have explained before, okay? The rest of the hotels, however, will load in the same way that we have seen above, represented with red color. But in a background, this is very important, it's in a background, the, the user doesn't appreciate that the search has not finished and he can start with the interaction with the website from the second three, okay? Okay then, 
now that we have explained this, let's move um, to know what are the benefits to your business. Here, we have tried to give you some points that you, you should consider, okay? First, the, uh, the first one, we are reducing the loading time and drop-up rate because we are, uh, we need only three seconds instead of 10. Secondly, improving user experience due to what we commented previously, because they are not aware that the rest of the result is still loading. And most importantly, we'll be able to interact. Thirdly, having a larger control to what content appear on top. And so it becomes an easier task to determine which will offer a larger potential benefit to your business. And the last one, and mostly as a tighter result of the reason mentioned, optimizing sales. Okay, now let's proceed with a demonstration in a, in a demo in life. Okay, the estimated time is around 15 minutes, probably less because it's, it's, it's very fast. Um, remember, that you can make some questions directly from the webinar tool. I will stop as soon as I finish the presentation to answer all those questions. <clears throat> to start the demonstration, we are going to open the intranet where I will show you the place in which you will be able to, to set up everything related to this model. I'm gonna open a new web page. Uh, demo Juniper okay. Internet. Okay. So now we are in. We will click on the drop down accommodation and we will go to Access Hotel Promoted. Uh, let me. One moment. What is now? Uh, Promoted hotel access, sorry. <laughs> okay, so in this panel, you will see how you, um, we have four different areas uh, where you can control which hotels we want to display in the first position on our results in a faster time. It's important to make distinction between the list uh, of accesses on the left hand and the three areas that you can find on right hand. Um, that mean that to edit the information of, of each of those accesses, okay, or these areas, basically. If we click uh, on new access, this is, if we click uh, one of these, we can uh, edit uh, these areas uh, to add uh, or delete the new uh, hotels, okay? But if we click in new access, uh, you can see how the area of data gets activated. Data has different drop downs in which you can determine the geographical area, the, the channel, market, uh, group of agencies, uh, and customer, okay? Um, so depends of your, of your needs, okay? This is only a demo, so I'm gonna choose here an area, uh, for example, for example, Barcelona, and I'm gonna say all, okay? Because this is just an example, but keep in mind that you have all these options available in our maintenance. Um, we are gonna press on save. Um, here, the, 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 other, the other two parts uh, is used to add hotels uh, manually, okay? Uh, you can see if I click here, I can add hotels from the top down. Okay, here appear some of hotels, but I have here a, predict, a predictive search that if I introduce here, for example, a hotel, let's see Hilton. Well, now I don't know what happened now. Give me one second, I'll try again. Now Hilton. Okay, no, now he's working. No, he'll, he'll turn. Now, okay, so I select the hotel and press on add, okay? Um, I can choose another one from the list. Now it's, it's already 
is already uh, charged, so I can select another one. And one this configuration is done, I just need to click on save. Okay, and at this moment, I have Barcelona already uh, set up. Okay, well, as you can see, it's very easy to understand and use. This is a uh, a very easy uh, maintenance tool, but you have uh, some doubts, just ask me directly from, from the webinar tool that you have in your screen, or just send me an email to know more about this, okay? Okay, so once we have uh, set up uh, all these areas, okay, it's time to see uh, what happened in our, in our website, okay? So um, I'm going to open some browsers now. Let me open some browsers. I'm going to open a chronometer also to check the time. I'm here. I'm here. I'm going to highlight if the module is switch on or switch off. Okay, let, let me explain you this part. I have two environments here, okay? One with parallel search off, that is 3W2, that you can see here in this URL. This means that this environment, the, power, the parallel search is off, is deactivated. And I have another environment that is uh, 3W2, Okay, 3WB, that the parallel search is on. Okay, I'm going to change this title every time that I change the screen, but this is uh, how, how this works, okay? just to see the, the sample. Okay, well, so if we move uh, to the maintenance, I want that you appreciate that for Madrid, I have 3NH collection here. Okay, so Parallel search here is on. I'm going to search for, for Madrid. Uh, and here, uh, once the, the search is finished, you can see NH collection at the top of the, of the page. Okay. So this is very fast, as you uh, could observe. It's less than three seconds. Let me, let me do it again. Just click on search, click here and it's less than one second, okay? Um, so if we move now to the, to the other environment that the parallel search is off for the same destination. Now we are only sending one request instead of two. For this reason, the search is uh, is not as fast as the before. Here we have only 212 hotels, so it's not the request is not very high, and this is test credential, so sometimes go faster, so sometimes go slower. But if we move to to another area with more hotels, as for example France, let's again. Uh, the environment when the parallel search is activated. And now we are going to search for Paris that has around 700 hotels. Uh, you, 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 you can appreciate that the search when the parallel search is on is less than two seconds. But if we move to, uh, and the hotels are, well, in this case it's 576 because depends of the data, availability, etc. But if we move to when the parallel search is off and we search by France. Uh, uh, same dates, go to lesson search. And here, uh, well, the request is, it's higher, therefore, the answer uh, is, uh, is eight seconds uh, instead of uh, two seconds. So uh, the difference is, is, is obvious, okay? You have a faster response 
you have the hotels that you want uh, in the first positions. So I think that uh, you have a website, you have a hotel. I think that this could be a good model for you. Okay. Well, um, this is uh, what I want to finish our live demonstration. Um, this is uh, everything that I want to, to show you. Okay. Um, I see that. You have some questions, okay? Not a lot. You have time now. If you want to uh, to send some questions, okay? The first one. I don't understand how this works. This is a uh, uh, cash. Then no, it's, it's not uh, cash, okay? Remember what we talked before. We sent two threads instead of one, okay? It's not cash. Is uh, the difference is the, in the first thread we are sending only 10 uh, well or the number of hotels that you uh, had set up in our maintenance okay but normally it's around 10 20 no more so if you send a request with 10 20 hotels the answer is faster that is if you send a request with 500 hotels so this is obvious the the value wage here is that with this model you are sending two hotels Two, sorry, two threads. Okay. Okay. Another, another question. I've already have recommended hotels. What is the difference? Well, you you already have recommended hotel because I'm supposing that you have uni hot, you have already uni hotel. Okay. So this is perfect. In this case, you can contract uh, parallel search without to to contract uni hotel as well. So uh, the difference here basically is that you are uh, you only need three seconds to show that recommended hotel that you have. Now you your website needs uh, around ten seconds. I don't know exactly your time, but normally around ten seconds. So uh, is uh, seven seconds less. So at this moment you are you are um, uh, winning uh, seven seconds. Okay. Okay. Um, more questions on product on product and external. Yes, it is. Remember. Well, um, I'm gonna upload this presentation in our YouTube channel and in our super online okay so you will be able to watch it again but remember at the beginning that uh, the, the, there was a diagram okay and 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 it was for both hosted contract that is own product and xml supplier that was external so yes it works with both yes um okay more question um the solution well i'm reading just some question okay because there are another ones that i prefer to answer via email okay because i don't understand it well or i want to to talk personally with with you okay so i'm reading just uh, some questions the, the the solution is not affect the xml connection no it's not only works with web at this moment only works with if you have a website with us okay uh if you have your own website or if you are working only by xml this module is low for you okay um another one well i have here um, regarding this uh, juniper scheduling and improving for xml uh, maybe we are improving we are trying to improve every day in new new models and in new uh, development so maybe i'm not 100 percent sure but but as soon as i have this information i'll send it to an email or, or a call or whatever okay well i have some other questions uh, I will answer you by email or, or I give you a call. Okay. And now um, to conclude it with the webinar, uh, let's move to the here. Okay. This is what well, estimate time. Um, let's make a brief overview. 
okay, of what we've, we have seen so far. Um, remember that parallel search is a model that allows to show hotel results for a website in a faster way, improving the interaction with the user. It helps optimizing your sales because you will be able to configure which hotels will be shown in the top position in a quicker way. And finally, research have demonstrated that those hotels that are shown in the top position and in a quicker way have a major conversion rate. Okay, finally, I want to remind that in case you have uh, another doubt or, or whatever, you can review this information in, in the landing page that we have about parallel search. Okay. As well in our support online that you have access from your support. Here, <clears throat> here you can find a link support online. If you click on it, we have here all the webinars. Okay, and if you click on it, go to the article uh, at, at the bottom of the page. You will be able to see a webinar. We just come in soon because it's the, this is the video that you are assisting at this moment. Okay. And uh, what else? Well, uh, as we have mentioned earlier, this same webinar will be uploaded into our YouTube uh, channel in a couple of days, okay? Uh, or tomorrow, probably. And in case you want to, to check uh, other, well, you can find this, 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 um, this uh, link if you go to our corporate website, at uniper.com, and at the bottom of the page, you can see here uh, YouTube. Button, okay, so if you click on it, you can see our channel. And here is not only this webinar; uh, you will be able to watch all the webinar that we have uh, from from now. Okay, um, and you can see here my contact details in case you want to contact with me to um, so to answer to give me a question or whatever you need. Okay, and that's all. It has been a pleasure to be here with you and I hope to see you again in next editions of our webinars. Thank you very much for your time.